Is it the battery or is it the alternator? Stick around to find out. Well, you're probably wondering why we're not detailing the interior of the car in this video, like we said in the last video. Um, due to the battery's dead in this car, so we're trying to figure out if it's a bad alternator or a bad battery. Let me tell you why. So, when we do, when we hook this machine up and we do an alternator check, it flashes, which honestly is pretty frustrating. Um, because I don't know why I'd be doing that. We got a new alternator about two years ago. So instead of taking the battery out, taking it to AutoZone, getting a check, uh, I'm gonna show you how to do a quick little kind of test to see if it's a bad battery or a bad alternator. Okay, so what I did here is I slightly loosened it so we could take it off. Uh, when we need to in later events. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna charge the battery for a couple hours. Um, we're gonna turn it on because all the uh, all you need to start the car is the battery. Now what keeps it running is the alternator. So what we're gonna do the little test is we're gonna pull off that uh, positive cable and if it shuts off then it's our alternator. So if it stays on it's our battery. Hopefully it does stay on because a battery is a lot easier to replace than an alternator but if it is the alternator we're gonna make a video on it just for y'all alrighty so it's uh, charging probably gonna head to the skate park in that time being that we have to wait so see you in a little bit All right, guys, so here's the moment of truth. You can't handle the truth.
Yes! Alright guys, great news. Um, took it off right there, did our little test. Um, if, if it was uh, the alternator, the car would have shut off because all you need is the battery. Um, so that's great. So now all we need is just a new battery and we'll replace it. And I promise you, next video is the interior of the car. Make sure if you enjoyed this video to like and subscribe. Have a blessed day, folks.